with over 27,000 new car registrations in July, this year's 152 plate has beaten all expectations. When it was introduced in 2013, we had hopes that it would begin to move registrations to the second part of the year. In that year, 67% of January's registration was where July sat. And this year, it almost equals January's registrations, 93% uh, and above. So looking really strong. It was very good for new car sales. It's brought the new car sales total to 109,000, almost 110,000 for the year. It's seen uh, new cars running at 48% ahead of last year's registrations. Light commercials running 48% ahead of last year's registrations, both for July. And heavy commercials 41% ahead of last year's. Year to date wise, again, the numbers are very strong. Uh, car sales 30% up, light commercials 54% up, and heavies, for various reasons, 9% up, moving in the right direction. The picture on used cars, uh, imported used cars are down, down about 14%, probably no surprise with the sterling differential the way it is, but overall used car sales are up, up 16%, which is a very strong performance for those. And all of this really drives extra revenue for the state. We've seen somewhere over 200 million extra in tax revenues just from new cars and used car sales for the year to date. In the Dundeal Second Hand Ireland report, David McWilliams said, the Irish economy has reached a tipping point. What started as a small bunch of online traders has become a mass retail movement. This is changing the way we shop forever. Irish people are buying and selling online in their hundreds of thousands, every day, every hour, from every corner of the country. And this is reflected in the motor section for Dundeal where the visits have got increased from 63 to 89 million for the first half of the year, and page views have increased from 847 million to 911 million. This is reflected in the, in the value of goods advertising done deal, which has increased from 1.9 billion to 2.38 billion euro, which has a significant economic impact. Dundeal is now Ireland's largest motoring website. Comscore, a global media measurement and analytics company, shows that over a three-month average in April 2015, Dundee reached 25.1% of the total internet audience in Ireland, and Dundee cars had a reach of 12.1%, representing the largest reach for any classified car site in Ireland. But the biggest impact is probably on employment. As an industry, we've seen 5,600 extra jobs taken on in our industry since June last year. But the story doesn't end there. As we drive on to higher registrations, we would estimate that we'll see 2,600 extra jobs in the next year. And even in September, we see maybe 450 additional apprentices being employed by our industry based on our member survey. So it's a very strong picture. I think we should be focusing on a market of probably somewhere ahead of 140,000 for next year, which is really back to more normal levels. And the only challenge for the industry in, in driving the market and producing really great value out there the focus on profitability is a key one for dealers up in the next year.